Okay, this is exciting, but we've used the bathhouse long enough now to realize this is stupid. <laughs> this doesn't function very well at all. Um, well, I mean, it functions a little, but it's not the greatest and it could be better. So we're about to make this better. Hello, raised garden bed. Goodbye, bathtub. You're going to be a cameraman or a helper? Because you're not both. <laughs> I'm both. I need a tripod. You're just oh. in a big hurry to I've get been... this out of here. Raised garden bed. Don't break any of that. We might need it. I think I'm going to plant zucchini in it. All right. Well, that was an easy rip out. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I cannot wait to show you guys what we got on the marketplace this morning. Old tub out. Puppies playing. <laughs> they are best friends. Okay, here is what we got on Marketplace. Okay, so in order to put my new Marketplace bathtub in here, we have to take out the sink and the platform that we originally built for the old one. I know. Let's go. platform has to come out, Jay. Let's take a look for him. Okay. So <laughs> be happy to. Thanks. Okay, so that's that drain's gonna be here. Okay. Right? Either Center. there or on the back. Yep. Yep. So you decide, but these have to come up because we need to use this okay. and we have to angle it, we have to angle it to where we can get it to go in. Go into our center drain. Yep. So these, these two have to come up if you're going to go here, these two have to come up if you're going to try and put it back here. Okay. Uh, I don't even know if you set it on here, but it's even going to hit either place. Why don't we... Get it, because you want to use this platform still. Okay. Well, looks like I have some cleaning to do. Ew. Disgusting. Okay. Gotta clean it. You clean it in here? A little bit. What the world's crappiest food mm -hmm. for them. It's terrible. We have spoke about this broom. Before? <laughs> it leaves a lot to be desired. It is junk. Okay. Well, I guess let's unwrap our new tub. We got this on Marketplace this morning um, for half the price that they are new. I'm excited about that. It was still kind of expensive, but... Anything from my princess. It was pretty reasonable 
Can you guys tell this is my favorite shirt? I wear it a lot. It's not like we're doing this every day and we're dressed the same. Literally, I wear this shirt because it's my favorite. Well, your hair looks great. Still Water Design Company. Oh my gosh. All right, so basically I got a brand new bathtub for half the price new. It has not ever been opened. Thanks. Buy a boat thing. Yeah. Is included in a separate marker. Why would they install a drain to make us put a different one? See, we're gonna have a big fire. Not with this one. It's beautiful. Wow. That is pretty very, bougie. It is pretty bougie for a bathhouse. I I'm gonna feel a little bit, you know, special. Fancy? Even in here. This is a fan it is a fancy bathtub, but like I said, we they sold it to us for half price because it didn't work in whatever they were doing. Hopefully it'll work for what we're doing. Oh my goodness. Are you gonna replace the chrome and put the brush in there? Well, you know I'd like to, but... Oh. Wanna get in with me? No. Why? I don't know, it's this, weird. Looks like that's a thing. the back of it. This goes to the door. To the wall. That goes to the wall? Why? Usually. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have to. If it goes the other way, nobody will see that. It's pretty, thin. it's pretty on all sides, right? I don't know if you'd get out of it, we could take a peek at it. Okay. Help. Yeah, I it think matters, uh, once it's it would be a lot easier to get the pipe where that's to the door. To the door. Okay. This is kind of awkward. So you got to go in first. I yeah, you go in first. Couldn't have been a whole lot bigger. No, I was pretty specific about the measurements. Wow. It actually fits. That was the other problem is like standard bathtubs don't fit. Oh, it's pretty. <laughs> you know what sucks? <laughs> is I can't put my sink back in here. No, I don't. That sink was dumb. Oh, what? Hey. Well, we don't have water in here. What? The it didn't really function that well at all anyways. It was so kind of fine. a waste of space. It was it beautiful was. and it was a great gift. But, um, We're going to use it for something deal. else. You know what really sucks about this is that uh, we sloped this so that all the water would go to this side. So we're still going to have a little standing water. You just have to sponge it out every once in a while. Well, I'll grab a level. I am curious about that. We actually have a level right. nowadays. It's not going to change. Well, actually, there are screw out legs on this. We could probably get it to. Yeah. Um, okay, let me measure what needs to go on. I'm going to go get a level because I am curious, and there are screw out legs to level it, so it should be fine. 
Are you going to push it up against this like it is, or are you going to space uh, it out evenly? Probably space it evenly, if that's possible. Mm -hmm. like. Screwed the legs out a little bit. It has some pretty serious slope to that drain also, so that helps. I'm glad you did that. Yep. Out we go. In, out. Out. Oh. You just sit up. You just want to sit up right here? Yeah, I think. Kevin. I gotta go figure out. This and the way my wife installs screw heads, you're never gonna get those out. Yes, I'm gonna get those out of there. <laughs> Let's see. All right, I'll show you kind of what we're thinking here. So, it's very hard to video in a tight, small space like this. Um, that pipe, we're worried, won't bend because it's a center drain bathtub. So we were thinking about running it straight out that wall, except for the window studs come down right here. So that's kind of a problem. <laughs> so we'd still, I, yeah. Anyway, we're going to start by taking these boards up, see what we have to work with, and then I guess come up with a plan of some sort. Good morning. Our bathtub project abruptly ended last night and we decided to start fresh this morning. So, yay, Greta's ready to go outside and get some work done. All right, so here's kind of how we left the project last night. Bathtub outside, which doesn't hurt it, it's waterproof. And it still looks the same in here. So we got to get to it and get some of these boards up and see how we're gonna plumb this bathtub. Hacha! Good to be. <laughs> what is it? What is it? Well, she likes it better when it has something to like a rope or something through it to run around with it. Sweet, that's the right bit. Okay, plan B. You need a pry bar? Nah, I was just gonna say plan B, maybe we should just cut it. Oh, Daddy put a rope on that. Cut what? Yeah, well, we talked about just cutting a jigsaw line to where we need to go. We did? Yeah, I'm getting like 50% of the screws out. Well, this one will never be seen, right? Okay. So if I could get that one out, that would be helpful. I mean, if you could just get this one out, and then really none of this is going to be seen. And the drain's right about here. Okay. We have to be able to try and get that bent over to there. It's just not that. Well, what does gonna work? Well, you gotta get me the goddamn floor up, bird. Uh, it's not going well. You want me to get it up? Go for a walk. You, okay. No, don't. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want you to ruin it. Laura. Jason, it's got tiny little baby screws in it. Where are the folks? Can you? <laughs> okay. So. Okay. So. There's a lesson here. What's the lesson here? The lesson that my wife needs to learn about when you install screws yeah you could just do it the way i need to do it and then it's undoable <laughs> it's not undoable it's indestructible like, my yeah, wife destructible my wife feels like if the wood is this thick she needs to bury the head of the screw probably at least that deep into it i don't like to see the and then, screw yeah but then you can never find it again or take it out. That's some of them. This is case in point right here. <laughs> oh. So it's okay. We're, we're, I'm going to have to pry some of these boards up and I'm not waiting any longer. So I'm going to go get a pry bar. Okay. I'm going to try and get some more screws up before you get that going. Oh my God. Scary. Oh. Who wants that? Come sit. Good girl. Good girl. All right. We got one out. And that's something. Come on.
got one out. Let's start. Pick. Yes. This one is definitely in there still. I got one out. I'm back. <laughs> Okay, I don't know. What do you want me to do with that? <laughs> um, well, wait, no. You, you are going to wreck it that way. Okay, so here's the thing. There's a thing? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Look at these. Don't fall over. Oh. What? You're going to wreck it. Or nobody's going to see it. Okay, hold on. I, if I pull these trim pieces off, I think that's what holds it on there. I can't get this screw out. But maybe I can get... God, it only has two screws in it. Somebody might see that. You are going to see this front reveal, aren't you? No, I, it's right up to here. Just... Mm -hmm. You think that it's... I think that there's still a screw in it right here. Sneak this off. You said this is all that's holding it. Oh no, she goes way under there. Oh, that's not good. 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 Oh, that's not
that out of here. Tape measure. Tape and measure. 32 inches. That's going to be perfect. Right in all that good stuff. Right where? Right in all that good stuff. Good. Okay. Yeah. So, that's probably work out just great for us. Okay. Mm -hmm. First plan of attack. The nice thing is these Z's don't fall over the ground. Why is that nice? Is a pipe can slip under there? Okay, do it. Slip it under there then. Okay. But instead of doing that, hold on. Can you stop? Can you just stop? You said do it and then you said stop doing it. When I say stop, it means immediately. I know what I was excited about it. What? Take your sawzall and just kind of give yourself a little bit of room under here. Okay. Okay? And then maybe we can stretch it over here. Okay. I have a really stuffy nose today. Mm. It doesn't look stuffy to me. It's not just running out the end of your nose. It doesn't look stuffy. That allergy's okay. Don't cut through the board. <laughs> you did it, babe. It is a really pretty cut. Well, and you're breathing the dust of 120 year old wood. It's disgusting. Yeah. Look at that. So that drain is right here? Or is it's it? really close. I don't know. Okay. I haven't measured how far in the tub it is. Like hopefully it ends up like right here. That'd be nice. I think that's going to be quite a bit further in than that. That, that would be nice. Are you eating rocks? No. No. Don't eat rocks. I don't know why my patience isn't here today. Hopefully it shows up. Your patience? Yeah. I'll keep an eye out for it. When working with Laura, first thing you should always pack is your patience. Hmm. And then working with Laura while babysitting two dogs, psh, forget it. What? I got nobody to blame but me. <laughs> Famous words of Travis Tritt. So who sings that? I got nobody to blame but me. Nope. I got nobody to blame but me. Seems like dancing part four. Right. That's all I got. That's, that's a lot. That's plenty. That's plenty, that. A dad will do you. Oh. Just waiting on you, Laura. Looks pretty cozy, Jay. I mean, I don't know what else to do. Okay. Just wait for me. If I had my way, I'd be turning it apart with a crowbar. Well, that but instead we're gonna not do that. I would like to not do that. I don't want to destroy everything, but I don't know. We might have to rip it apart with the curl bar because I don't think I have that tiny little square bit that I need. What's she doing? Just she's about to get tied up. <laughs> we could put her in the So when I took that off this whole thing. Well, I thought it dropped, maybe not. Well, it's at least workable space. Does it move up and down, this no, thing? I don't think so. It's just an optical contusion? 
thought it did. Yeah, and it didn't move. It didn't move. even touch it. No. But if we put an extension down? Was that a question? Oh. <laughs> I mean, how did they know where it was at? Yeah. Well, let me see here. Because that pipe's pretty much sitting on the floor, right? Yeah, what is that? I don't know. Right here. Okay. Huh? Yep, I found the pipe. Is it pretty much sitting on the floor? Pretty much. Okay. Show me here where the drain is. Right there. Aha. Okay, I see now. It is going to land right in the middle of... So I am able to touch it now, by the way. That's good. So, but the support right here is probably going to have to come out. I don't even know why it dropped because the feet aren't sitting on anything. Right. Oops, sorry guys. So, whoa. Um, so that 2 by 4 going back to the walls in the way? I think it's really close to being in the way. Close enough that I might as well take it out of there. Well, but we could move it further this way, which would actually be nice. Okay. Well, we're all the way here because... Well, okay. When, when you're sitting in here, and you're leaning up against this, mm -hmm. it would, your head would be less. Okay. Yep. I'm fine with that. Let me see if I can hop under there and find it again. Do you know what? Do you need glue? No. I need that to be longer, huh? Okay, so I think we can, we have six inches down from here because this base basically sits on here and this is six inches down. Okay, so it. let's, let's be okay with that. Well, you don't have to put that up there. Okay. There will have to be a board on the front of here. For this mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, okay. mm -hmm. So it's actually going to be an additional almost inch, okay. three quarters of an inch anyway, because okay. that's three quarter inch okay. wood. So, so six, we'll just say six and a half. That'll keep it up off the floor. Okay. Six and a half inches down from here, which means this end should keep me I'll be right back. This end should plug into there, this end should plug into there. And then that should be just super easy. It's going to be super, super It easy. sounds like it'll be super easy. Clean it up. Good. Your job is done? My job is done. I'm out. I'm actually going to go see. I swear we have to put the plan Um, So I'm really close to trying to put these floorboards back now. So don't leave. Yeah, I'd rather you know. Okay. My dainty little... My dainty little man hands? Dainty little feminine fingers. Yeah, they're not... Okay. Something about me. I have no, for real. Humongous working hands. You can pull that up off the floor a little bit, right? I think, yep, I think so. And we're going to have six plus... Three quarters. Okay. So that would be six and three quarters. Six and three quarters. So if I just went. You never claimed to be professionals. Mm-mm. Nope. Yawa finest. Put this down to seven. Okay. We're going to lose a half inch there. That's six and a half. And another inch here. That's five and a half. That's so then we're up off the floor in here. Right. We should be able to shove it in. Right. You're dangerous. 
Are you getting this? <laughs> Milwaukee, I apologize. We're away from the top. Okay. when we set this down the pipe that we installed doesn't hit the floor hmm. <laughs> okay yeah let's hope or we will be done again for today I actually yep oh push it back in a little what back in a little yep that's fine hmm. huh I said hmm here's what? the fun part Mm -hmm. Did you just make like a... Mm -hmm. Was that a Kermit the Frog one? It was. Oh, no, I didn't have a very good Kermit the Frog voice. You really? You look like Kermit the Frog. No, I don't. I'm not green. I do love green, though. Better than Miss Piggy, I guess. Mm. Okay. <laughs> just get your damn gloves on. Let's go. Okay. Fingers crossed. It's gonna, ah. work. It's gonna work. Meow. I think it worked. Jason, quit bumping my camera. Well, I can't even move in here. No. Looks like she needs to be. Where'd your level go? Ha! Oh, boy. No, oh God. Oh, beep dip. It needs to come up a little bit if you want it to on the back. Drink, yeah. Okay, how's it left to right? Still could go up a little bit on this side. Uh -huh. So up and up and up. On the up and up. Is that them. pipe hitting the ground root? No, we got about like this much. Two fingers? Yep. Okay. And I think so. Okay. I think we're going to be able to make that work. Oh, hi. There's plenty That's of room. Help. Come on in. Can you screw yeah. some of those legs out? Well, I'll just have to tip it back up. Oh, no. Really? Can't get in here this way? Well, maybe. I don't know. Let's just do it once and it's, that's going to be good enough. Okay. Because so the more we move this, the more chance of us breaking that plumbing is. Yeah. Like now I don't know. Well, I can try and screw the legs. If I put something under it, you know, lift it. Put the well, can I tap it? Can I lean it this way for you to get under there? I don't think I can reach them. No, because they're like right here. My arm is it. What are we doing? I was just leaning it forward. Oh. Because I don't check that plumbing out. I don't think that'll hit anything if we move it forward. I can't see anything. I think we'll just put it back the way it was. Screw the feet out. I can't reach, honey. But if it was tilted all the way up it's on its side, you could. Yeah. Hold on. Just cool. Peaceful. Easy feeling. Alright, 
playing this game. Okay. I will play this game. You're one out front here, so well, too far. Okay. Oh, Grady, you gotta come outside, hon. You're so helpful. Well, go on, go on. Good girl, good girl. If I pick it up, can you just screw this one? This one, you went too exaggerated on this front one. Yep, it's just the front one. Okay. It's good. All I do gotta do is just pick it up, set this under it. Yep. slope from here to here towards the drain. Only kind of crappy thing is it's a little high on this side and these are screwed out about as far as they can go. I think we'll just have to go with that. When we built the platform for the original one, we sloped it this way because the drain was all the way to this end. But I think that's going to work. Did you get it? It's looks like it's tilting towards the shabbin. It is. That's all right. I mean, it's not. What about this way? This way, it's it goes towards the drain. Okay. So. Fine by me. I mean, we originally built that platform. What did you do? Put some spacers under this? No. Side? I think that's fine. I mean, as well, long as it goes you, here. If you put this down here. Uh -huh. I mean, it's got a pretty good slope to yeah, it does. the drain. So now the only thing. Um, Here's the thing. Well, now you got to get out of there with your little tiny female hands. They are not that small, folks. Show them your hand next to mine. <laughs> so whatever. Look at no, show. I have freaking man hands. What? Look I at, do. But look at the fatness. You have fat hands. Okay. So I'm going to go out there and we start lining that pipe up. You know what we're trying to do under there. Yeah. Get it into that fern coat. Yep. And you you can move that fern coat a little bit, but it's... Try not to. Okay. Let me let you get your bearings about you there. Yeah, it might take me a second. It's just going to have to take patience and time and patience. How is it? Um, the angle is wrong, but I think if Which I way? could get my two hands under there. Do you think that the drain needs to be cocked more this way? Yes. The, co the drain has to be turned more that way? My end has to come my way. I mean, I could pull it. The problem is, is I need two hands. Mm -hmm. And I was able to turn this just a little. Okay, I think we've got it all hooked up the best we can, and I think the next step is we dump water in the tub to see if it leaks. We definitely have torn the bathhouse apart and made a huge mess. Let's go get some water. Okay, folks, here's the truth part. How good did we do? Please no drips. The good news is they don't see any drips yet. Wow. How'd it go? It's draining beautifully. Can to go get me one more bucket of water? We don't have that much water to waste. Yes, we do. Uh, you just dumped an entire bucket down there? Yeah. And you need another one? I just, yeah. So you can see too. I don't need to see him. <laughs> I, we got, we're gonna have, we're gonna have eight people here by the end of the week and 30 gallons of water. So we're not wasting water. I don't think it leaks. 
Well, there's no reason for it to, really. Not really, but I'm not the world's best plumber, so I don't I don't have the most confidence in my self. Okay, well Laura, what? I did all the plumbing except for one connection. Yeah, the, right. And it would be that one connection, you know? Okay, so I think for now we're gonna leave this trim board off the front of here so we can keep an eye on it over the next couple days after we bathe and shower. Um the other good news is is I was worried about the bathtub being level this way, which it's actually high on this side, but it still all goes straight to the drain, drains out beautifully, and no leaks below. All right, now I just gotta clean it up in here. It's a flipping mess. Maybe put some trim back on. All right, here we go. Your hair looks awesome. <laughs> Well, you kind of look like Greta. My wife's been tearing my shower apart for the last three days. Might actually finally get to wash my hair. It's only been two days, day and a half. Okay, let's talk about this bathhouse. I think we finally got her figured out. So, we took the sink out that was originally in here because we've never used that sink since the day we installed it, so it's pointless. And we have a little bit more space. And our new shower system is literally just this submergible pump. We've been boiling water and using this ladle the past few trips because our gas land froze and broke. And quite honestly, it's just a complicated system and we don't need anything that complicated. Simple is best. So submergible pump in the water that we boil. And then it's just got this little shower head in here. What's really awesome is we have a very stable, beautiful bathtub. And I think it was worth tearing our bathhouse apart. Um, we did not connect the trim down here just to pay attention, see if it leaks at all. And we'll watch that over the next couple days when we shower. But yeah, bathhouse. Done. Check. I think we did good on the whole bathtub. It's a freestanding tub. I think originally, so we got it, it was brand new in the box and we only paid $500 for it, which seems like a lot, I know. Um, it was originally $1,100 at, I think Home Depot is where they had bought it from and it didn't work for them. So yeah, free st I think we made out okay. Less than half price. Yep, so there it is, folks. A finished functional bath house with no sink. I don't know what we'll do with that. How's my hair? Let's not talk about it. <laughs> it hasn't been washed in a couple days. It's beautiful. But we're going to be able to take showers tonight, and that's mm. really exciting. So I'm taking a bath. Oh, might as well. We can now. So mm, We might run out of water if we start taking baths. Yeah, that's true. Mm. Yes, so bathhouse, check, done. I think it was worth ripping it apart to put a better bathtub in. We should have done that to begin with. Well, and... jury's still out because I haven't been in there yet. Well, yeah. I would say... Probably good it's idea. probably good mm -hmm. so if you like the video like the video you know but don't don't like it privately actually like it you know what i mean give us a thumbs don't up don't just sit on your couch and go mm, i like that i like that <laughs> yeah actually Sub I don't know subscribe that, that would help our channel grow squirrel we love making videos so that's yeah. it and comment of course we'll get back to you as soon as we can and we love reading them so Hey, shingles update. Shingles update. Still here. Yep, still alive. Um, it's a, it's a bad thing, but um, yep. Yeah, see all the, I think for the most part, all the external uh, scars and wounds are what they're healed, gone. Healed, healed. But man, the internal, the uh, nerve pain. Yeah, it's bad. The nerve pain's still yeah. here. It's been a little over a month, but we still got him, folks. And his hair looks great. <laughs> all right. Thanks. We appreciate all of you. Bye.